This year, Feeding America announced that hunger is at a 10-year high. In light of this news, let's double our efforts to get more wholesome food to our neighbors than ever before. Welcome to the latest edition of Feeding Change, our monthly video newsletter where in four minutes or less, you can learn how the store is changing the way hunger is addressed in our community and how you can help. I'm Colin Mayer, the CEO of the store, and I'm delighted to be with you. You know, in my first months as CEO of the store, I knew I needed to dedicate myself primarily to listening, listening to the voices of our customers, listening to the insights of our donors and volunteers, and listening to the perspective of our community partners. Well, four and a half months in, that is what I've done. And I tell you, through all of my conversations, the message I've heard again and again has been clear and consistent. First, that hunger is growing in our community. It's growing for seniors, individuals, families, and veterans. And second, there is an urgent need for the store to do even more to address this mounting challenge of food insecurity. Well, today we are saying yes to doing more. I am thrilled to share with you our new initiative, Nourishing Our Neighbors, Doubling Our Difference where the store is committing not just to doing more, but to doubling what we have done in the past. In previous years, we've served around 350 households and unfortunately had to turn away hundreds more due to lack of capacity. Well, this year, the store is committing to doubling the number of households working with us from 350 to 700. And friends, this initiative is not just about more groceries. It's about building a future filled with hope and dignity for our neighbors facing hunger. If the need is growing, our response must also grow. Every edition of our video newsletter features one spotlight on somebody that's making the difference for the store and food insecurity. And today we have our donor and volunteer, Christine Price. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. So tell me how you got involved with the store. Well, we moved from California a little over a year ago. And when I was there, I volunteered at a pantry and I really loved that. And I knew I wanted to get back into volunteering. So when I started asking around, everybody said, you should go check out the store. So I did some research. I signed up to volunteer for a shift and I have been coming here ever since. Yeah. And it's been about a year. We're so glad you did. Thank you. In your opinion, what makes the store unique? I think it's unique because our guests can come in and they can actually shop for the items that they want and need. Uh, it's such a great experience for them. We love helping them. Uh, I see a lot of joy on their faces when they come in. Yeah, that's great. Well, you're a volunteer, you're a donor. What makes you want to support the store? I love supporting the store because the motto, love at the core, really resonates with me. I, feel like food is my love language and so I've always wanted to support any organization that does that so we're happy to. Well Christine you embody love at the core so thank you so much for being part of our community. Thank you. Edition of Feeding Change concludes with a call to action, a tangible way you can contribute to the store's mission. And this month I encourage you to take one hour to learn, to learn about the store and to learn about food insecurity by attending one of our monthly lunch and learns. These sessions offer not just a delicious free lunch, but also the chance to learn about our work, to take a guided tour of the store, to meet our staff and volunteers, and to deepen your involvement with the store. And when you sign up, consider inviting two or three friends to join. Just use the QR code displayed on your screen to register and we'll look forward to seeing you then. And that wraps up our February edition of Feeding Chains. And I just want to say thank you. Thank you for your unwavering support. Thank you for your enthusiasm for tackling hunger in our community. And thank you for your partnership as we endeavor to double our difference and assist even more neighbors who are hungry. Until next time, let's continue to spread hope and keep dreaming of a community where food insecurity is a thing of the past. See you in our next edition, if not before.